I extend a warm welcome to all of you on this special day, 11, 12, 13, when Honorable Rashpati Ji will launch two innovative schemes and also hand over smart ID cards to the resident of the President State. I request Secretary Ma'am to give her welcome address and also for the introduction of the scheme which will be launched by the Honorable President today. It is indeed a proud day for us and a very happy day for us. It is the birthday of our Honorable President and since he has been a source of inspiration for all of us to think creatively and think continuously, uh, this is a fit occasion for us to launch these two programs. One, on launch of writers and artists in residence program. The second one is innovation scholars program uh, in residence program. This, these two ideas have been with us for the last one year, but we were unable to implement them, sir, because we didn't have the facilities. With the commissioning of our guest house, now we are in a position to receive these guests who can be with us and share with us the life in Rashpati Bhavan. We like to think that we lead a very happy, contented, and creative life in this campus. And we do think that a bit of this should also be shared with all these people who are creative and have the potential of molding the value system of the society. We will like to encourage in, the, in these artists, writers, and innovators a spirit of inquiry, a spirit of peace quiet, and quietude, a spirit of oneness with nature, and also a spirit of camaraderie with the fellow beings. We see a great erosion of positive thinking in the society. We are hoping that this little vocation that we will provide these uh, special people will lead to a generation of a stream of positive thinking in the society. So the schemes, uh, we have set up the committees after consulting all the stakeholders for the artists and writers, we have been in touch with the Ministry of Culture and for innovation uh, scholars, we have been in touch with the Innovation Council. Uh, of uh, India, which is supported by R&D Ministry, uh, sorry, the Science and Technology Ministry. And we have set up committees which have an adequate representation of the right kind of people with right kind of uh, expertise. Uh, it is our, it will be our endeavor to select eight people every year, four innovators and two each, writers and artists. They'll come in batches of Four, we would like to see how the interaction between a writer, an artist, and innovators yield the, the results of this uh, interaction between these three sets of people. We'll also try to provide them opportunities to interact with the community in the Rashtrapati Bhavan. We'll arrange talks, shows, interactive sessions with the Rashtrapati Bhavan people. And we will, our expectation from them is only that they'll recharge their batteries and they'll go back as better artists, better writers, and better <laughs> innovators. For innovators, we'll try to establish a linkage for better designing and for better, uh, uh, better designing of the innovative products that they're working on by establishing a linkage with the IIT or the National Institutes of Technology. It's a beginning, sir. We'll be on a learning curve for the first year, and I'm sure we'll gather some very valuable experience, which will make us run this scheme much more efficiently in the times to come. On the, uh, we, we are starting another initiative today, that is of giving uh, smart ID cards, which are biometric cards for the residents of the Rashtrapati Bhavan. This, I'm sure will make life much easier for all the residents and for the security people and the administration. I must congratulate our technology team who have been working very hard in putting all these initiatives into shape. 
uh, I must also acknowledge the very good work which has done by Venu, our press secretary, in formulating these schemes and in uh, helping us uh, give it a shape by running around to all the ministries and all the other stakeholders for getting, getting their support. With these words, sir, I again welcome you and thank you for being with us this evening and for being a source of continuous inspiration for us to do better and better every time. Thank you, sir. Uh, may I now request Honorable Rajpati Ji to launch these two schemes on our website. From the website, that opening page which you saw, if once again anyone clicks it, this whole scheme it, with all its details will come down. At the bottom of this scheme, we have provided links for people to apply for the scheme online, both for the innovation scholars as well as for the writers and artists in residence. We have also provided forms which, if the writers or artists are not sufficiently technology friendly, they can send it in print application. Uh, today, as now that you have clicked it, it will already go onto the website, and as of now, it is officially launched. But tomorrow, we will also issue a small press release and publicize to the media that the scheme has been launched on your birthday, sir. And we hope we will get a large number of uh, applications in response. Hopefully in the new year, once the applications have been screened, the committee has met and decided on who to select, we would be able to operationalize it as quickly as possible. Thank you so much. Before we switch over to the handing over of the smart ID cards mm -hmm. to the residents by Honorable Rajpati Ji, I would like to make a brief presentation on the smart ID card project which we have initiated. Sir, in the President State, we have around uh, 1,699 number of quarters in which around 6,000 people are staying. The basic aim of the project has been to facilitate the stay of the residents with proper identification system. The other important uh, problem has been about the entry of the guests and visitors of the residents in the President State. So we plan to address this important segment also. Sir, as far as this project is concerned, we have already carried out the survey of the residents in the present state, and their family details have been obtained. All this information has been digitized, and at the moment, we are in the process of collecting biometric information like thumb impression. Thank you. 